This minor, insignificant, seemingly small and incidental meeting between these two college students turned out to have significant legal and intellectual property ramifications as well as economic. Just for a little small meeting, there's some interesting principles in here. And again, one of the key ones being that the inception and the birth of an invention and the birth of a process require, requires very strong foresight and vision to have a good idea of how the marketplace is going to react to that. I know a lot of inventors who think they're really good at this, and they're not. They smashed in a stampede, right? Yeah. But it wasn't because they saw pictures of hot girls. You can go anywhere on the internet and see pictures of hot girls. Yeah. It was because they saw pictures of girls that they knew. People want to go on the internet and check out their friends, so why not build a website that offers that friends, pictures, profiles, whatever you can visit, browse around. Maybe it's someone you just met at a party. But I'm not talking about a dating site. I'm talking about taking the entire social experience of college and putting it online. I can't feel my legs. I know. I'm totally psyched about this too, but Wardo. Yeah. It would be exclusive. You would have to know the people on the site to get past your own page, like getting punched. When he's talking about getting punched, he's talking about being invited to join elite groups known as a final club. It has nothing to do with violence. And a lot of people have disputed this about the Facebook movie, The Social Network, and said that, you know, I went to Harvard and there was no such talk about any kind of final club or things like that. They may dispute that and it may not have been part of their Harvard experience, but it is still to this day a very big part of the Harvard experience for a lot of people. And final clubs still do exist and they are exclusive and they do have a much greater level of applicant pool than the people who are accepted. And they can affect the outcomes of things that happen to you 10, 15, and 20 years after you have left Harvard, after students have left Harvard. Final clubs are not incidental. And part of the birth, at least from the Part of the birth of Facebook, at least from the deposition transcripts and the discussions that uh, people made under oath, under penalty of perjury, hold, and I hold, that the thought of a final club and the thought of having control over who gets to join your exclusive uh, community were based partly on final club principles. And number two, one of the key um, forerunners to this exclusivity process was the thought that the Winklevoss put into Mark's head about having it be available only to a very select group, people with the harvard.edu email address. Thanks for watching. Let me know any other topics you want me to discuss. This YouTube channel is to help you. This is for information. I want to hear from you and I want to know what things are on your mind. 